Good morning, YouTube. It's so nice to get back out on the water. In addition to all the things that I mentioned in that last video that we've been busy with, we spent last weekend in Seattle, so fishing time has been really sparse. Uh, while we were up there, we got to stop off at Din Tai Fung for some soup dumplings and Funko headquarters. Check out all the, the giant Funkos and the special releases that they have. And uh, also we stopped off at Taylor's Shellfish to demolish some oysters and uh, some crab and I jumped on a bison statue. But the main purpose of this, if you couldn't tell from the intro, was to catch a Tay Tay concert and it was on fire. Uh, I think I'll show a couple clips at the end of this video instead of fi fish cutting. <laughs> but um, let's just enjoy this sunrise, uh, figure out the drift pattern, and let's get on some of that bait. Some little fluttering schools just before sunrise. Oh, baby. I think one, it felt heavier than this. It felt like one might have came off. But that looks like uku bait. Unfortunately, we didn't get a ton of bait. We got some pretty nice pieces. Oh, this one might have been the one I wanted to put on wire. He's a little bit bigger. But we're bringing back the uh, troll cam. So let's see if uh, that guy can go fetch us something nice. So this AHA came and really started harassing this bait and busted him up quite a bit. But uh, eventually he let him go and the bait kept pressing on, soldiering on. But uh, he was a little gimped up and as you can see his, his back end was pretty tattered. day so far it's already eight o'clock and it's really my first bite I had this uh, Opelu out on on the cam line it looked like he had a touch but then I uh, the camera was about dead I think anyway so I put that same Opelu down low and as soon as it got down there it got hit sitting in like 250 or so bumpy out this definitely feels like a fish though Ooh, the wind
pretty blowy for only eight o'clock. 50 feet. Got some color. Looks a little bigger, looks like a jack or something. Kahala maybe. Yeah, Kahala. Shucks. Hard to handle these when it's this wavy. Turn over, buddy. Ah. Okay, sketchy released. Not a huge one. Maybe, I don't know, 20 pounds, I guess. be edible might have when they're smaller they got less worms but kind of borderline Start recording. Oh, I missed it. Start recording. I think there's a bait on that second line already. I missed him. Fifty left. Oh, this guy's spinning me around a little. About eight thirty now. Ah, oh, looks like a cava. 
pretty silver. Just some commentary. I really made sure this camera was on and I did this for a long ass time and uh, I had zero underwater footage of this Kava Kava. to bet that was a little school and that other line was the same thing so I'm not so mad I'm not so sad I guess that I missed them let's get that other line in and get up oh, bring them first and then let's get that other line in and get a beat on that other line He's got a lot of sea lice on him. Oh, this lice. They're harmless, but kind of gross looking. No, slipped hook. God, I felt it just turn too. The reason I didn't set that hook good is I thought that was the circle hook. So I set it in the same style I would on the circle hook. And um, it was on wire with J hooks. 
so I really should have set that one. It's unfortunate. Uh, couldn't tell which line was which because I switched them off because they were kind of crisscrossing. The waves are just kind of nuts right now. So, and the current's kind of nuts. So that guy's beating hard now. Might be I got a second chance at this. I'm just gonna go back to running two lines. One on floral and then one down. Running the third line right now is uh, a bit too challenging. Crazy windy. It's getting pretty sloppy. Oh, it's getting pretty sloppy out and uh, Ah, uh, plus I'm up by myself. So I think I'm gonna start heading inward. Uh, it's like 9.15 only. Pretty short day, but at least that line's still out. Oh. I see it busting on the surface over there. Oh, aha. Uh -huh. Dumb. A waste of a bait. Seriously? My... I'm just gonna mute it here because there's a lot of swearing but uh, I'm pretty sure this is why people go ahead and set your guys boats on fire man Fat uku. Oh no! Oh no! Fat uku. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, I should have fucking gaffed him. Oh, it wasn't hooked that good. Rushing. Man, that was a fat one too. Ay, ay, ay. Live to fight another day, lucky guy. Live to fight another day. 
Oh man, that was a big one. <laughs> Shucks. Ay, ay, ay. I should have cogged him. That one had like at least 18, 17, 18 pounds. I hope this is something worthwhile. that big from far away when it was jumping but maybe he's just using the current well but he's fighting pretty hard big wave Big guy. Big guy. But sure caused a lot of havoc. We'll 
snack size. Probably, I don't know, eight to 10 pounds or something. Nah, not even 10, I think. I don't know, mahis are always weird. They, uh, to me, I always underestimate them because they look way bigger than they are. Hook came out. Make sure he's dead. Guy under the seat. <sighs> Shucks. I ripped my nail on the cooler. That did not feel good. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell.